They have a really strong chance of keeping the pick. I know that going into the off season and just based on how previous off seasons have gone, we were expecting perhaps for the Suns to trade this pick, but because of some of the restrictions in place for them on the trade market, their options are pretty limited. The three needs that they have, they have point guard, they have wing, and then they have backup center. You're going to be able to find that type of player in this draft. Starting at center, I think the two guys to watch on draft night are Eve Missy out of Baylor and Khalil Ware out of Indiana. Missy is an incredible athlete, near seven footer. At point guard cam, you've got Tyler Kolek, who is the name out of Marquette that a lot of people have been talking about the comparisons to TJ McConnell. Finally, on the wing, you've got two different guys. Colorado's Tristan De Silva is the one guy we're watching the most on draft night because he has a skill set perfectly catered for you've got a bunch of superstars. I think the wild card in this part of the draft cam is Illinois' Terrence Shannon Jr. He was recently found not guilty of uh, felony rape and aggravated assault once his uh, court situation, his off-court situation got cleared up his draft stock started to become a lot more tangible. It's Bronny James, it's Rich Paul, it's LeBron James. It's getting a lot of headlines, rightfully so. Uh, but maybe if they trade down about 20 spots, Cam, we can talk about Bronny.